would suck if I hit my lens. So we're not gonna do that anymore. Calm down. <laughs> uh, okay, so what is going on my fellow markers? It is Parker J. Whale. What's up? <laughs> Last video, I was talking to you guys about the fact that I'm trying to get myself into painting because it's super therapeutic and it's something that I've always loved doing. And a few years ago, I made like a handful of paintings, but for some reason, I just kind of fell out of painting and just didn't do it anymore for whatever reason. I don't freaking know. But as I explained, I've been kind of going through a lot and I need like a healthy outlet to just express myself because that is something that I don't really freaking have. And so I did paint. It's freaking beautiful. I don't know if you can see it. Oh my god. But I think it was like a couple of weeks ago and I started getting like abstract paintings and just like painting videos in general recommended on YouTube and I just started watching them and fell down big black hole. I'm still holding this, okay? I need, to, I need these. I'm, you know me and talking with my hands. So I started watching a ton of these videos and like super addicted to like, you know, like I'll mean to go to bed but then I end up just laying there for like hours watching paint videos. There's a couple of channels that I'm gonna link down below. If you're super into art, you will definitely love these channels. I just want to give like a huge shout out because these are a lot of the channels that I've been watching recently and super freaking inspiring. So the other night, like two nights ago, not last night, but the night before, I decided to finally film that paint video. I was kind of talking about it in my last video, how I said that I would film, you know, maybe one of my next paintings or something. And it was actually the first time fully attempting a painting with a freaking belly knife. There. <laughs> Dude, I love this thing so much, but I think I need one with more of a neck. I don't know if you can see this, but like painting with this thing is kind of hard because my knuckles are like scraping against my paint. <laughs> but I have so much fun with this thing. It is so freaking cool. Like I watch a couple of artists use it, paint their entire abstract paintings. It is so freaking cool and so much fun. I absolutely love it. Because with this painting, I kind of did use it, but like only for the lines and everything. Like my background was just kind of like with a brush which is kind of cool. But like, I really just wanted to try an entire painting with just a palette knife. I don't know, it's something I've never used before. I've always, like growing up, always used just brushes. That's just, just I'm just, just a brush boy. I'm just brush boy. What is that, does that mean anything? I don't know. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna, I'm, gonna... <laughs> I'm gonna show you guys the footage that I got from me just kind of like painting my abstract painting, my first one with a freaking palette knife. In the future, I'm definitely gonna be like filming in the daytime, like this would be the perfect lighting, as you can see. The other night, it was kind of like a test, I wasn't, it looked fine to me, it looked fine to me, like on the freaking viewfinder, I was like, okay, this is good, we're good to go. Exposure is fine, you can see the canvas, but the more I added the dark paint, the darker everything just got, and the exposure was really weird, it's kind of blurry, it's kind of grainy. Things that don't matter that you don't care about, but I'm really picky about, and I just, what am I talking about? So check out this cool first little test video of me attempting to paint. I'm so excited to do more. Oh my freaking God. And I'll talk to you guys in like a minute or two. This thing goes by really, really fast. All right, I'm gonna be, I can talk, okay, boom. Welcome back. <laughs> You're still here. I'm gonna put this back over here. Stay. Okay. 
All right, so my first freaking abstract painting with a palette. No, I can get calm down. Dude, I'm absolutely in love with this painting. I love the colors, like there's purples and blues and blacks and it is so freaking cool. Like, I had no idea what I was doing, but that is the beauty of abstract art, <laughs> okay? I can't wait to do, oh, dude, I just wanna paint right now, but I wanna film this to talk about it so that I can film more painting videos and it, it'll just, it's just, it's, oh. Like, I posted pictures and everything, but you can't really see the purple, like, on camera, like, when you take a photo of this, the purples and everything turn really, really blue because, I mean, I don't know if you're gonna be able to see right now, like, the purples and the blues because there's a difference between the purples and the blue, but I had that so much freaking fun with this like just the way all the colors blend like over here looks super galaxy to me i do not know okay so probably like parker what the frick okay so i didn't end up filming a video for this because i actually like hung out with my friends downstairs we gathered around like the kitchen table the other night at like 2 a.m like a couple hours after i made that first painting and i ended up painting again and oh my god these colors are my favorites this is like a teal sometimes it looks green to me like right now it looks green but like, honestly, earlier it looked blue. It's probably gonna look blue to me in a couple of minutes, but oh my freaking God. So this is the second painting that I did. You know, I did my first one with the palette knife and the second one, I feel a little bit more confident. I kind of had a better idea of what I was doing. Not really, just kidding, don't listen to me. I'm gonna be fine. But check out these freaking colors, dude. Oh my God. I know I keep going on about the colors, but I freaking love them. I'm definitely gonna be using these again. And honestly, one of my favorite parts about this is how muddy it gets over here with just the colors like really, really blending and then complete opposite on this side, like solid, nice, vibrant color. The canvas kind of like pops out in some places. Like I like that it looks messy and that it isn't completely covered. I don't freaking know, sorry, I'm just nerding out right now. I'm just like, dude, I make these paintings and I stare at them for like hours, just like admiring them. Like, I'm like, A, I can't believe I did this, and B, I don't freaking know. So this is like my favorite painting that I've done, honestly. Out of the three of them, this one is probably my favorite, and I'm probably gonna feel the same about newer paintings that I do. I'm sure like when I see my improvements or just trying different styles or whatever, like, I don't know. I'm just, I'm having so much fun. <laughs> Someone, <laughs> don't call nobody. I know I said I was going crazy, but please don't lock me. So I don't know if you could tell, but I've been feeling so much freaking better because I've been painting. It is so therapeutic. Dude, it is so cool that so many of you have been tagging me on Instagram and just showing me your artwork. I even saw like a ton of comments where you guys were telling me that I've kind of inspired you to get back into painting or just art in general, which makes me so freaking happy. Okay, wow. No, but seriously, that is so freaking cool. So I'm definitely gonna be filming another art video really freaking soon. I can't wait to just set up my camera and paint again. Look at all of these colors. Okay, I posted this on Twitter and someone was like, I thought that was your makeup palette. <laughs> Can you imagine? <laughs> no. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay. Uh, okay. <laughs> So you guys should totally check out my freaking art Instagram, which is Parker's Studio. Boom. Somewhere on the screen. I'm going to be posting like all of my art over there. I'll probably still post some on my main Instagram because why the frick not. But for the most part, anything to do with art is going to be going on that Instagram, whether it's like digital art or painting or drawing or whatever it is that I am up to in, you know, the art realm. Yeah. <laughs> What am I doing? I don't know. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Drop a like on it if you did. If you enjoy... Did that even... Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a freaking like on it. It lets me know that you enjoy these types of videos and it kind of like helps me know that you want to see more. And I will definitely be posting more art videos really, really soon. And it's getting nicer out. I'm hoping that, you know, the freaking snow all disappears and melts and never comes back. Ever. I don't like it. It makes me sad. I'm definitely gonna get back into it vlogging and stuff. Oh my god, dude. I know this is supposed to be like an art video, but let me nerd out for a second. You guys remember my old... I took this on a freaking tour. It's like this fish eye little like Vixia Mini X. Like, I don't know if you guys remember this, but I keep forgetting I have this and I want to freaking vlog again. Does this thing still work? I think the battery's dead. <laughs> Anticlimatic. But like, as soon as it gets nicer out, I'm gonna be filming a lot more. Like, I always feel super, super good in the spring, in the summer, in the fall. 
Winter is just depressing as frick, so that doesn't help, but I'm really excited for that And so you're gonna be seeing a lot more freaking content, especially since I'm getting out of my head I'm expressing myself. I'm feeling better. So <laughs> I just want to give a huge thank you to Damien and Kevin on patreon Thank you guys so much for your support over there If you want to come check out my patreon, it really helps me out a lot it helps me keep doing what I love to do So it really really means a lot even just just even <laughs> I can't talk. Links to everything down below. Anyways, I love you guys. Stay strong, stay beautiful, stay you, and I will speak to you all really freaking soon. I love you guys. Thank you so much for everything, and all right, I'm going to be quiet now. Okay. <laughs>